Hey guys, it's your girl, Confident Plants, back for another video. It is time for the October 2nd paycheck budget. Let's go ahead and get started. I hope that you are doing well today. And if you're not, I hope that it gets better. All right, and I don't share the amount, but it's just a habit, so to write it there because this is how I plan my budget. Okay, so the first item, let me zoom in a little bit here. Um, my paper got something on it, but it's fine. Like I wrote too hard, so on a different sheet, and so it, um, the indentations are on here. So let's get started. The first bill is rent, and that's four ninety five. Hulu, I pay five nine nine. My internet is currently fifty dollars. I'm not sure why I have a credit. It's normally sixty, but it's fifty right now. And I will take it. Netflix is thirteen ninety nine. I share this with a friend. Um, and then in return, she pays for our, um, Sam's card membership. Apple Music is $9.99. I attend art therapy. I go twice a month. And my copay is $35. We have book of the month. I'm in a book club. Bookworms and Winos is what it's called. And um, that's for my book. Guardian is my dental insurance. My separate policy outside of work that I have. My car insurance for this upcoming pay period. $72. I have a Kindle Unlimited. I'm probably going to get rid of this soon in the next couple of months. I haven't been using it as much as I thought that I would, so we will be getting rid of that. Um, my Apple iPhone payment will be $40.32. I got a new iPhone that I'm filming on. And then I also have an iPad. So I have Apple Care for the iPad. And that's gonna be $6.64 a month. Um, so. Um, and usually, I know if you are oldie but goodie that I usually have my iPhone um, payment on my first paycheck. But this is when I got, uh, when I received the phone, was in the last half of the month. So that's when the bill is going to hit. All right. And we'll fill that in later. And then let's go on to expenses. The first one is miscellaneous, 40. And this $50 has been working really well for gas. I've been driving a lot more now that things are opening up and I've had some travel. So this has been working well. Um, probably if things are back like they were, you know, before <laughs> BC. <laughs> um, before the panorama, which is what I call it, but you know, before the pandemic, um, then I'll probably increase this. Cause I was doing, I wanna say 60 or 80 a pay period. So we'll see how that goes. I'm enjoying saving on gas money and staying home more. And I don't have a commute to work. So that also helps. So allowance, I get $100 per pay period. Um, and then my nails, $40. 
I probably need to increase that. Giving 40. Eating out. Groceries, 140. Planner supplies. Twenty car maintenance is a hundred. Technology is a hundred. Oh, it's fifty for emergency. Medical gets twenty. Christmas is on this check, um, on the upcoming check. Clothing. Oh, I'm gonna run out of space. It's okay, I'll figure it out. Gifts is 20. I should have started up higher, that's okay. Um. I'll just go here. 16. My goddaughter, she gets 20. Saving to get my hair done. It's almost time. I'll be going sometime soon. And then Amazon, I paid my membership for the year. So I'll be saving. Oh, sorry, you couldn't even see that. I'm sorry about that. So my goddaughter gets 20, my hair 20 in Amazon. Since I paid it um, last month, the whole thing outright, I am going to start saving $10 a month so that I can um, pay it off when it's time again. And it ended up being like with tax, like 129. So I'll need to just add in a couple of dollars here and there to catch that up in time. But it's no biggie. I'm glad that it's paid. I'm not... I save like $36 or something like that a month of a year by paying it all at one time. And that as you, if you've been following me for a while, you know, that's been one of my goals for quite some time is to do that. So this budget's working because I'm able to save. Um, all right. So this is $890. And then we have savings number three. Um, yeah, all right. And I always tell people I don't share my amount. Also, this is not all the money that I have in accounts. This is just what I share. Like, this is what I spend per paycheck. There are other things. Like I have money going to other accounts for savings, um, for things that I want to save up for that I, I don't talk about. They're not really relevant to this um, channel, but there's things that I save for. I have a cushion, I have other emergency funds. So I have other things going other places, but this is what I choose to share. And so I hope that it's helpful. Um, it really does work. I really do. This is the bulk of what I expend out, like everything that I spend. And so this is how I'm, you know, choosing to save money. If you've been following me for a while, I did save $10,000, over $10,000 last year um, by using this system and it really does work. So I hope that you enjoyed the video today. I will have another video up on Sunday. And so I look forward to seeing you then and have a wonderful day. And remember, the best way to accomplish your goals is to make a plan. Bye.